Hi guys, this is Chase with All Seasons RV here in Streetsboro, Ohio, located at 9043 State Route 14. Uh, today we're going to be doing a video here on our 2022 Flagstaff Microlite 25 BRDS. This camper is 25 feet, 11 inches in length and 5,300 pounds. If you guys have any questions after this video, uh, feel free to contact us on our Facebook page at All Seasons RV or give us a call at 330-564-0222. Um, so getting into this video here today, we're gonna to do a full walkthrough on it, tell you every single thing about it on the exterior features and the interior features. If I miss anything or if you guys have any questions after the video, just get a hold of us. Uh, so on the front here, we do have a power tongue jack up and down, nice and easy with a light there for you, help assist you hook up seven way plug holder here as well. Um, this camper is an all aluminum frame camper with a heated and enclosed underbelly. Uh, it does have two 30 pound propane tanks. We supply the two six volt batteries here with our all inclusive pricing. So no extra fees hidden on top there. Um, nice front cap here with the uh, glass, the windshield glass there. So it's gonna provide more natural light uh, during that nighttime. Um, coming through here, full pass through storage. Good part about this, uh, you can get it from either side that you want to. This here is going to be even more storage. Uh, we recommend fishing poles for this because the storage goes straight up to the top. So plenty of room there for a fishing pole. Extra storage here, this is gonna be up underneath the dinette area of it. This camper here is a dual axle camper um, with the Dexter axles. So it is the upgraded suspension for you. Coming over here, it is a little tight. Uh, we do pack these things in our showroom. Uh, so antifreeze inlet here, something I wanted to talk about. Very, very easy, makes winterizing your camper a thousand times easier. Uh, black tank flush on here as well, as well as the outdoor shower. Hot and cold on that outdoor shower for you. Coming around the back, you do get the uh, full size spare here with the ladder going up to the back. A lot of the camper brands are not doing the ladder anymore, um, but Flagstaff still supplies that for you guys. And then coming over to the actual camping side of the camper, uh, you do have a awning stretches out eight total feet here. Uh, right now we can only get it out so far. We got the steps right next to us, but we do have an outdoor kitchen with some storage, a two burner uh, cooktop with a outdoor mini fridge. There is a spray hose here that will plug in right here with hot and cold spigot. Um, so no outdoor sink, but you can still spray stuff off, which is awesome. Uh, they provide you with that. You do get a prep table and it will come with an outdoor griddle set up too. Uh, so you get the two burner and the griddle. It's the best of both worlds there for you. TV hookup, 110s with a cable outlet here as well. But the Goodyear tires on these two, so they're not gonna be um, different kinds of brands. This is a well-known brand Goodyear. Uh, they supply you with that with the TPMS system. So the tire pressure monitoring system, they give you a separate screen comes with the camper, tells you tire pressures on it uh, as you're traveling down the road. Another cool feature about this is it has seamless windows here. So seamless windows, they're gonna help with black streaks. You're still gonna get them, but with this being a vacuum bonded fiberglass, it's gonna be a thousand times easier to clean with the seamless compared to the seam windows. Coming to your steps here, they are the gas strut assist. So very easy. Um, as you can see, I could literally let it go up by itself. Anybody can do this nice and simple. Um, putting it back down there for you. And then you do get the door with the window as well. Um, does come with the shade already. Screen door here. The shade does come down and provide this complete darkness for you guys. So that's enough on the outside. Let's go to the inside of the camper. So now we are on the inside of the camper here, right next to the door. So this is going to be Flagstaff's Murphy bed setup here, okay? Uh, so very simple, very beautiful design too. It kind of hides the bed. Uh, so if you have guests and stuff like that, they're not going to be seeing your bedroom area or anything like that. They do provide you a curtain if need be, um, but you do get the couch here. Couch is big, both sides recline here. Uh, you do get the cup holder spot that folds up, provides extra seating. Um, but the way this Murphy bed style system works is you have the two pins here. You're going to make sure that both of those are unlatched. And then at that point, you're just gonna see the strap here. You'll pick it up like that. Bed folds out there um, for the couch system. And then you'll bring down the bed here. Just watch pinching your fingers up here. But other than that, you're good to go. Keep on bringing it down. And then you'll hear it click. That's gonna lock into place now at that point. Um, around the bed, you get plenty of storage. 
Right behind that curtain up there is gonna be that front cap window I was telling you about on the exterior. Uh, so it does provide some natural light in there for you, which is really nice. Uh, plenty of storage around the sides as well. You get uh, three different uh, counter spaces here around the bed, as well as 110s and USBs throughout the thing. Um, on the top of this, there is a 190 watt solar panel. Right here is going to be the inverter button for it um, to turn that on and off for you. So that's the Murphy bed. Let's get to the rest of the camper here. If we come this way, we have more storage here. It's gonna be a good pantry size uh, storage area here, um, canned goods, whatever you can think of here. And then a nice U-shaped dinette. Now this is definitely a family camper. Um, feels cozy and big, but you're still, you're still kind of all one unit together kind of thing. Um, this does fold down into a bed for you. Storage up underneath as well in these drawers. Coming around here, even more storage here for pantry storage, anything like that that you can think of. Um, this here is going to be the access panel for your water pump in your bathroom area. So they make it nice and easy if you do decide to winterize this thing, if you're not parking it inside an enclosed storage area. It's nice and easy to get to everything to get all that winterization part done. Um, your counter space here in your kitchen, they provide you with a nice pull up, gives you a lot more counter space here. And it's very, very simple to get up and down. It's not one of them older styles where you had to play with it a little bit to get it up and down. Um, and then solid surface countertops here, all the way around here. And then the glass on the three burner cooktop is going to provide even more counter space for you. So that's definitely a plus. Counter space is always looked for when we uh, have customers coming in to look for campers. Then a push, push me thing here. You'll push this up, it'll come right up for you. And then you get two more outlets, two more USBs. You do get a TV on a swing arm here, microwave, uh, range hood there with the light and the fan for it, and then a oven. Plenty of storage again. This camper has way more than enough storage. Uh, fridge is going to be 11 cubic feet, 12 volts, all electric, can run off your battery, can run off of the seven way plug, uh, and then off of shore power. So you'll have no issues with that. We've heard zero complaints about those fridges and they're just bombarding the market right now. Um, coming to your bunks, two oversized bunk pads here. One of the big highlights of it. Um, another cool thing about their bunk system, I wanna point out, you get storage underneath, but let's say if you wanted to take bikes or something like that, you're just gonna fold this bunk pad over and then you'll lift this up and lock it in a place in the back there and that's more than enough space to put a bike in. So definitely, like I was saying, it's, it's a family camper for sure, but you can definitely fit a ton of stuff in this camper while you're traveling down the road. Uh, going into the bathroom area here, you do get a shower with a tub lid. Um, the Max Air fan is a big one here. Everyone seems to look for that, and it, I understand why 100% it pulls out all the air. Um, now this, this blue piece, we get a lot of questions on. What that is, is it's the shower miser. Uh, so when you're going to take your shower, you'll have one of them valves turned. You'll see that that blue part is going to then turn white. When that blue part turns white, it means that the water's hot. So in that case, you're, you're constantly circulating the water until it's warm, saving yourself water at that point. So definitely a cool system that they included in there. Um, it's something that's kind of slowly making its way into the industry but there's zero complaints on it so far, so it's definitely a great system. But that was a uh, good little rundown here of the Flagstaff Microlite 25 BRDS. Uh, again, the weight was 5,300 pounds. The length is uh, 25 feet 11 inches, so just under 26 for you. But if you guys have any questions whatsoever, feel free to contact us. Our website is asrvs.com. Facebook page is All Seasons RV, or you can call us at 330-564-0222. Thank you. Happy camping.